Uh, we're going to do this. This is a first look, another first look. This is Outpath First Journey, which is a prologue chapter of the main game, Outpath, which isn't due out till next year, uh, 2023. This is um, developed by David Morel Joe Sanchez, published by Grab the Games. Thank you once again to the publisher for the game key, uh, for bringing this game to my attention. Uh, it's much appreciated. Uh, as usual, it doesn't affect any opinions I express during this video since they are my own. Right, let's load this up, give it a whirl, see what we think of it. It's a casual base building type game. So, um, and made with Unity. And we have adverts for now. Right, let me just check my settings here. We'll just leave it at that. Let me put the music, the sound up a wee bit. Eh? More options in game. Okay. Right, let's hit the play. I should gather some wood and fibre. So this is me. Oh, that's turning a bit slow. Can I change anything? There. Oh, we've got FOV in here. Guys will be happy. Yeah, I really don't need... To bloom on. Hold the click. Can I change that? Down to 60. I'm just going to close my curtains because it's pitch black outside and I don't want to be like a goldfish in a bowl. My window's just there, so, and my bright lights are on. There we go. Right, did that. That just sprouted up there. Oh, we got a log. Let's build a workbench now. Structures menu is Q. I'm just going to lower that down again. This is quite loud. So it's like a 2D pixel thing. Can I go up there? Oh, wait. what's that? Looks like a mushroom, maybe. Oops, oops. This isn't cannon jump anywhere. Right, Q. We have got utilities, production, magic, and farming. We were on the workbench. I quite like the menu. That's quite neat. I can't build that, I need fibres, don't I? Where am I going to get fibres from? The grass? Yep, right. It's quite bright, isn't it? Can I turn the brightness down? Yeah, it's very bright. It's very in-your-face bright. There we go. That's a wee bit better. I like the way the trees spiked up. Do I have enough? No, I need one more fibre. That's my partner saying. She's having trouble with the steam deck. I'll see if she'll bring it through. <laughs> so I can have a quick look at it. She's streaming it from her computer, so... Streaming the game onto the Steam Deck. 
Right, oh, that tree just grew right up in front of us. Okay, now we can maybe build this, um, this workbench. Okay, I'm going to put that there. Can I rotate on the spot? No. Right, we have a workbench. It just looks like a Minecraft workbench, doesn't it? So I can make lots of different things. What can I make flint out of? Stone, okay. What do I have on me? I've just got some wood and that's it. Can I break that? No. Can I break that? Oh, that's coal, okay. Right, we've got some coal. Let's get more. More, more fibre. Oh, and we've got copper. Great. Okay, we've got copper and stone. What can we make here? Production. What's under there? Nothing so far. Right, we can make a research table, but we I don't want to make that. Marshed berries. I wonder if that's your health. Can I make that? No, I need flint. Right, so I should be able to make... I need three flint. Okay, so we need to get more stone. And more fibre. Whoa. Trees go really quick. See, so this is just the prologue version of the main game that's coming out next year. You have to click, you can't just hold the mouse in. Button it in. Oh, it's worth coming up here. There's a lot of clicking. <laughs> that spawns straight away. Oh, what's that over there? Right, let's see what we can make. Make more flint, make the marks. It's quite a nice clear interface. Uh, right, I want to make that. Oh, I need more fibre. Is that enough? One more. Right, let's make that. One attack damage to trees. Okay, there we go. I can equip this tool in the inventory. Okay, so that's equipped. Okay. I should research recipes in the research table. Yeah, we're going to. But I fancy making the other items first. What was that? What flowers over there? Let's get our pickaxe if we can. Oh no, we need more flint.
Okay, we've got 10 flint. We've got 10 flint on us, right. Okay. So we should be able to make that. What, we need 25 fibers. We need to go looking for some grass. Oh, what's that? A bear bush. Oops. <laughs> Hopefully we didn't lose anything there. That gives us a flower, obviously. It's nice, relaxing music. See what this thing is. This totem. Got 17 fire. So what's this? Expand biome. Buy a new biome. I can expand or buy new islands in this monolith. Okay. This reminds me of Forager then. But then 3 3D. One more fiber. There we go. So I can expand the biome or buy a new biome. That's a lot. Look, we've got two new bits. Right, I want a. Uh, Pickaxe. Uh, can I make a sword? Do I need a sword? I need a shovel, really. Let's get more flint. I still need more flint. Oops. Don't fall in the water. Let's grab this. I I got a pick, didn't I? I presume it's Oh look, I can swap between them, yep. Quite pretty really. Forger quite a lot. I did like it. It's quite a relaxing game as well. And then we're flint. Oh, we can make nine. I'm just going to make the shovel next. I need more fiber. And then we'll make the um, research bench.
Right, let's make this shovel. Oh, I need more fiber. Don't know if I need to fly or something, I'm just clearing the place out anyway. I'm gonna get some more wood. It really is just like um, Forger, but 3D. Oh, what's that there? Okay, not much fiber, are we? What's this down here? What's that? Oh, flint. Uh, and we just... Where's the food? Extra damage. Ah, oh, okay, okay. I'm looking for more of this. Right, we've got 28 fibers, we should be able to make a shovel. Right, okay. Um, let me equip that if I can. What do I need for this? What do I need for this? Two, plus two extra... Oh, we've got a butterfly. Let's just craft all these. For 60 seconds, okay. So we can... Click things quicker. Destroy things quicker. They take a long time to cook, don't they? Mm, last one. Oh no, one more. Oh, there's the butterfly back. The grass is quite effective, isn't it? Right. Uh, flint sword. Oh, we can make that. What do we need sand for, do you think? Right. So we've got all our things there. Can I swap out? No, I need to. I do need to equip it. Okay. Uh, right, we want a research table. So it's Q. So we need eight wood. And uh, let's just get our arcs out again. I could um, eat one of my food up, but I'm not going to. It's a cow. Oh, we've got an orange as well. It needs a bottle. Okay, I'm not going to attack it. I 
good, very quick. Right, Q. Let's put that there. Okay, so we've got a research table. We can do a skills shop, a furnace, and an inscription table. Uh, better do that one. We need to. Okay, so we need to use our points up. I don't want to take up too much space down here. I don't know if I can destroy these after. Oh, it costs even more, look, to expand our biome. At least you can leave the research running while you're having a wander about. There's a chicken. <gasps> we got an egg. Looks like part of it. Oh, wait. Need a bottle to milk that. What are we doing here? Right, we may as well do this. It allows you to smelt ores and forge other types of objects. Right, so I presume we can now build something in here. Oh, we need glass. Oh, we've got a jump pad, right. So we need glass and brick. Furnace. That's what we need. We need ten stone, right, let's do that. We've got an anvil. Right, a few things, eh? Right, we need stone. Let me get my pickaxe on the go. That's flint. That's flint. Your flint as well. Let's just pick this copper so that then. Um, some stone might appear. Oh. Oh. I can't remember how much stone it said. That was it, right. Hmm, where am I going to put this? Over here? It'd be nice maybe if you could rotate the thing. Maybe you can, but it's not telling me you can. Right, there we go. Ah, coal and brick. And glass. Right, we need sand. Right, we know where sand is. Well, we need sand for the bricks as well. Right, so how many... We need two and two, so... I'm going to need more stone, but I'm going to need four sand for that. And ten, so fourteen sand. And a lot more brick. There was sand over here. Here's the brick. Oh, I need the shovel. What on earth is that? More flint. Alright, let's go find some rocks while we're waiting on the sand to respawn.
It looks like you can climb up. Almost. There's no more rocks. Can I do bricks? Might as well leave one going, right? I'm going to have to clear out some of this so that um, other things spawn. What's that in the water? Oh, it's a fish. No more sand. are growing, respawning really quick. Apart from what I'm needing. I was trying to get to 2000, I wanted to get a different biome. got 2,000. We still need more sand, it's not respawning is it? There's our brick. Still need more sand there. Still no sand, right. I think we're going to have to... Let's get to the 2000, get another biome. Maybe attack the two slugs or whatever it is. It's a turtle. Okay. We've got a turtle shell. Nothing. We're up to 2,000, right. Let's try... Oh, it's two and a half. I thought it was just 2,000. Right, as soon as we get to 2,000, we'll do the biome. No, don't hit the cow. Cow keeps saying I'm getting in the way. there.
Doesn't seem to be a limit to how much you can carry. Right, that's us. Biome. Oh, is that away over there? That's miles away. It's not really what I wanted. Okay. <laughs> right. We need more sand. Ah. It's three sand. Right. We can make one thing at least. Um, glass. We've only got one brick. Still need more sand for that. There's another fish. What else can we get over here? A description table, spinning wheel, anvil. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's the furnace. Right, what do I need to do the anvil? We don't have enough for that, right. Okay. okay, right. We need more sand and we need... We've got plenty of coal, so it's just sand. It's just taking forever to respawn. I can't get that was that's just flint. I think we need to definitely just buy more lawn just now. See if we can't get any more sand. So we need 200. Oh, we can teleport to the biome. Can I teleport back? Ooh, maybe I can. There's no sand here though. It's, oh, we've got, what's that? Gold, okay. Don't really need gold. So we, we really just need to enlarge the area we've got. All that for two bits of gold. What's this? Iron, okay. Spawn quick, doesn't it? It's better you don't get some sand off of the flint or anything like that. Well, let's see what this gives us. Oh, it's wheat. Oh, we need that, don't we? For growing. What's that? Beetroot. I thought that was maybe a carrot. Right, let's head back and see if our sand has respawned anything. I quite like the totem design. Right, let's see if our sand. That's so slow. Oh, we've got enough to expand though. Let's do that. We get any more sand? Oh, we got one more sand. Right. Oh, we got three, two more sand. 
Great. Right. We just need that to spawn. And that'll help out a lot. Wonder if you can catch the butterflies. It's no sand, it's so slow. Just wonder what the noise was again. What on earth is that up there? What's the cow? Let's chop some of these trees down. Can't do that. Oh, we can make bread. We need flour. How do we make flour? Of course, we need glass for that, don't we? That's what we're trying to aim for. Um, let's go for that. Allows you to craft magic-based items. Okay, leave that. Let's go check our sand bits, see if we've got any sand. Nope. Why is sand so difficult to get? Five hundred. We're going to do that once we get five hundred. There we go. <laughs> More sand. How do I get over there without dying? There's no sand over there anyway, look. Seven sand. I don't think that's enough, but let's head back. What was I doing? Oh, I was in here. Glass. I can still just do one. <laughs> Right, let's go try and get more sand.
five. That should be enough, shouldn't it? I'm not usually on stream at this time of day, cause, um, but uh, since Baron was badly injured at the weekend, we're having to, I'm having to keep an eye on him in the mornings while my partner's at work. Um, let's go and make whatever it was we were going to be making. It was um, that, wasn't it? Skills shop. Can I not make it yet? Need another bit of glass. Uh. <laughs> I'm just gonna put that here. I think. Can't put it on top. No? So what's this do? Foraging. Reduces objects health by 8%. Fish respawn. Okay, so we don't do that yet. Impatience. Creatures spawn 10% faster. Magic weapon deal 30% more damage. Okay. Alright. Okay, so we can obviously expand that, can't we? We've got a cauldron. And we would have made the other thing here. Craft bait. Yeah. All right, let's get more bricks made, but we need more sand for that. We need four sand. I have to find a bigger area, really. I should have maybe put them up there. Guess it doesn't really matter. Any sound of it? Yeah. Oops. Okay, that should be enough sound. So that's going to take 40 seconds. How much to expand again? 950. Right. I'll maybe build them up here, the next lot of benches. Because it doesn't look as though you can move them. I'm just doing a first look at this this evening. See what we think of it. Hmm, I wonder what's way up there. This is the free prologue that's on um, Steam just now. The full game's coming out next year at some point. More sand over there, look.
Okay, let's go build. What thing? Go. Fair. Hello. Welcome, readers. Where's my keyboard? How are you this evening? What have you been playing? High on life. Oh, I saw that. Is it any good? That would allow humanity to live until Yo, your new rig. <gasps> oh. Are you using it? Or has you not got it set up yet? It's gross, okay. Various ideas has a better Scotch accent than you. Okay. Oh, <laughs> righteous. As we just consumed everything <laughs> that we came in contact with in the hope that maybe what we could create uh, from this would make us happy. But it never So did. um Yeah. Now imagine I said that or if what if I meant what if I gave you this alternative, which is we would live highest life it's not any good then. Yeah. But that's a shame. We would be satisfied and we would be peaceful in and our in ourselves and towards each so other. So you you got your there would be no war, there would be no Yeah, it's it's a bit like I don't know if anybody's played Forager. That we would deny it's a bit like Minecraft and Forger, but it's more like Forger than anything else. Something we had to make happen, but the natural result of people being free. Okay, it's fun. Okay. Definitely not a farm again. <laughs> okay. No, I'm just. This is just a free prologue. Uh, the full game's coming out next year at some point. It's called um, Outpath. I think it is. I think it's out path. It's quite good. I, but then I I quite enjoyed Forager. So um, there's some crafting in it and research, and you've got to you can use your experience. Don't fall in the water. <laughs> you can use your experience points, which is the number up on the top left, to enlarge your little islands at the totem pole which is over here so like I can expand my biome so this so I've got more areas yes I have played my time at Porsche a lot and I also have played my time at Sandrock the new one I like those games Have you played them, have you? Yeah, the new one's very good. It's still in early access, I think. Um, there's certainly a lot of nice improvements on the second one. Uh, I got sent a copy of Soundrock by the publisher because I... I, um, I streamed some... Porsche beforehand while they were doing their Kickstarter for Sandrock. But yeah, no, the new one's very good. It's a completely different environment. It's bigger. I really want to do that, but I really also want to expand my land out. This is sort of research thing here. Yeah, I might. I'm going to do this. I'm going to enlarge my biome. So we should have a few more areas we can travel to. Yeah, we've got that bit over there now. Sand is a problem. You wouldn't think there'd be a problem with getting sand on an island. Some islands. All this looks like sand. <laughs> okay, there's some sand over there. Everything spawns really quick. See if I can get over to there. No, fell in the war. 
So like I've got a crafting table I've made, if I can see it through this tree. Um so I can make flint and sand from that. I made my weapons on there as well. I don't I maybe I did. I didn't notice. Did I? Let's check, because I've only got 149, so it doesn't matter if I lose it. No, I didn't. So at the moment, there doesn't look as though there's any penalty for, for landing in the water. Uh, I also bought another, a completely new biome, which is that one way over there. Which I can teleport to. So there's the island I was on. So there's different things here. We've got beetroot here. And we've got wheat. It's quite a simple game, but it's quite quite relaxing. Mm, we'll just teleport back. I had to turn the brightness down, it was really bright. <laughs> right, where's the totem? Lost the totem. Oh, it's there it goes. Sorry, I just need to respond to this message. My mum asking how Baron is doing, since he was badly injured at the weekend. Uh, this is our, our research thing. I need another, I need more for that. And we've got our furnace, so I can cook some meat, make some bread. I don't know how to get flour yet. Um, we can build things. We've got our inscription table, which we could build now, actually. Let's do that. Was that not? I was going to build that up there. I'll just put it here. It's all Minecrafty things, though, isn't it? Like the inscription table and um. Okay, Vow. Thanks again for the raid. Much appreciated. Um, hopefully catch one of your streams as well. You take care, be and enjoy your supper if you're having your supper. Yeah, enjoy enjoy your new computer as well. You'll have to let me know how it goes. How you're getting on with it. it. Takes so long to reinstall everything, doesn't it? We've got paper, we've got a magic branch. Makes a big difference having a new computer. Wonder what a black bone's for? copper bell. Right, do we have enough for this? No, let's try and get this so we can actually gather things quicker. We just need 450. I'm not sure what we, oh, we need a bug net. There's a lot to it so far. Yeah, we can get eggs off of the chickens, obviously. Okay, that's just got enough to do this. Let's unlock this. Okay, so we can do that again. It costs a lot, doesn't it? Fish, craft time reduced. Creature spawn faster. Nope, oh, trees in the way. Right, what else do we need here? Um, spinning wheel, we need 200 for that. 150, 500, we've got a jump pad. Right, let's, let's try and get some more experience here.
For anybody that doesn't usually watch me, I, I usually tend to do first looks of games early in the mornings. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday and Friday. Uh, I play adventure games on a Wednesday. And JRPGs at the weekend. Schedules are a wee bit different just now, just because it's... Um, I have a few days off work, so I can stream longer. Um, plus, um, because Barn was injured, I'm sort of streaming at a different... Or one of our cuts, that is. I'm um, streaming at sort of different times. So there's always somebody with them. Don't hit the cow! Right, let's go see if we can unlock anything for that. This lets us build various things. We've got that. Got that. We don't have anything to do with farming yet. Let's maybe do the spinning wheel. We'll leave that researching. Let's go gather up some sand, because sand's always a problem. There's probably a lot of sandy beachy bits here. I need to get round there. No sand. Mm, I think I need to go from there over. A lot of sand over there spawned, didn't there? Oh, oh, made it. Didn't think I was going to make that. Okay, that's quite a lot of sand. This is for flint. <laughs> it's hard keeping up with everything, so it spawns so quick. You've got an inventory as well, so you can see everything you've got and how much. All your food, and so you can eat it. Um, crit chance. Extra click damage. Got all our weapons. Uh, our recipes. Oh, spinning wheel is done. Maybe we should go back and make that up now. Let's try and make the spinning wheel. Oh, I need two bricks. Just as well, I've got sand, right? Done. There we go. Oh, one brick. I wonder if you can queue these up.
Oh, did, did that finish that? Oh, see, it stopped it. Okay. So we might need a few of the furnaces if we're wanting to do lots of different things. If anybody likes these sort of games, um, Forger is definitely worth a look at. Um, but it's more um, pixel art top down. Uh, let's get this other brick. This definitely looks very promising. I would definitely play this um, when it when it comes out. Just a nice casual game. I haven't had to attack anything yet, even though I've got a sword, so I don't know what um, what sort of things you get under attack by. What was I building? I was building this thing, wasn't it? Spinning wheel. It was quite big. Let me go up here. <laughs> Feel free to wish us wish list the game so you get notified. I will. I will put it on my wish list. Right. Oh, we can make thread. Leather. Oh, we can make a bug net and a fishing rod and a bag. An attraction cape. I wonder what that does. Right, bug net. I need three thread. Oh, that's quite smart, isn't it? I like the clouds as well. well let's get rid of this tree because it's in the way. Right, so we've got our thread, um, we were going to, I could make, oh a collection net, oh. we've got a mill as well, let's get an anvil on the go, oops, right, what was I going to make, I want to make a bug net, Oh, I made that up here, didn't I? Up, up there. I need one more thread. So I'll just message partner. Right. Okay, so we've got that. Let's do the bug net. We need. Oh, we. Where did the thread go? Oh, it's down behind. Right, we need... We need a copper ingot. What do we need for this? Why don't we make four more threads while we're doing it the other bit? We'll need two copper ingots. So you can leave all these running. If you can see them through the trees. Yeah. And it's exactly like foraging that the stuff just gets dumped on the ground just now. Like that. Right, that's our copper ingots that we needed. Right, let's make our bug net. And then we'll make a fishing rod. What's the bag for? Reduces resources are worth 10% more. Ooh. Right, we're going to have that. We need five, th 15 thread. We need two, mo three iron ingots. <gasps> I thought I had the iron at work. Obviously not. to find some iron. Do 
It's all just copper here. Maybe there was iron across at the the other island. Right, we've got our we've got our bug net. Let's go over to the other island. I think that's just stone. Whoops. There. Oh, that looks like iron. Yeah. Didn't need too many, did we? Hopefully you'll get better tools so you don't have to click so much. Of course I could use um, some food, couldn't I? Eat. So I do more damage. When you can see at the top how much time is left. Two more iron. It's all stone. Right, may as well just gather what we can here. Gold. Before my food runs out. Right, let's just go back. No, 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 Looked on the wrong thing. There's our first island away over there. We've got 13 iron. Let's try and get to 20. Then we'll head back. Right, where's the totem? Don't upgrade the island. Right, well, we, we needed iron. Can't remember how many, but um, let's just go for the marks. They take quite a while, don't they? Right, and this was to make the fishing rod. I could do with a bag, really. Let's well, let's get some thread on the go. Ten of them. What's the working gloves do? Enables hold click mode. Okay. Increase pickup range. Got some points we could spend. We recycle a spreader. A breaker. Right, what could we... Hmm, we could speed that up. Hmm. 
Mm, let's do that. An artifact. Okay. We need feathers for that. Okay. Where's the artifact then? On here. Right, let's go up here. 15 thread we were going to make the bag and then we'll make the fishing rod we haven't made the fishing rod have we let me just double check no we haven't tried the net out yet have we we'll go try catch a butterfly there's one whoa <laughs> i need wings just like the butterfly Got it. An aqua butterfly. Don't know what they're for. But we've got one. Oh, there's our bag. Alright. So, that's here. It's an, oh, it's an artifact. Okay. Resources are resources are worth ten percent more. Okay, we haven't made that. Oh, there's our anvil. Right, can we make the anvil? We need three copper, two more ingots, and two bricks. Wait. Can we unlock anything else? No. Catches objects from time to time in the sea. Okay. That's quite nice. Allows you to turn some plants into ingredients. Gives another life to useless items. Generates plants over time in nearby blocks. I wonder what that is. Uh, that's our copper ingots. What else did we need? Two bricks. <laughs> One brick. There, right. Um, anvil. Let's just plonk it here, away. Eh? <gasps> mm, right. Make nicer things now. What does this take? Three copper ingots. Let's set them going. Right, what else did we have up here? We had... Did we get our fishing rod done? No, did I not make my fishing rod? Right, I need eight thread. And we, we need another... Copper ingot. Let's add another one onto here.
It's not updating that. We have got four, but it hasn't updated that. Right, can we make this fishing rod? We can. We'll give fishing a quick go. Um, am I going to need these? I won't be able to um, need 10 thread. Okay. Right, we need a lot more fibers. Okay, but we now have a fishing rod. Let's equip that. Let's see if we can catch a fish. How do we work this? Oh. I'm not quite sure how that works. Let me try and find a fish that's nearer. No good for a nut. Is that the only fishing fish there is just now? <laughs> oh no. Where's all the fish gone? <laughs> Don't have any. Oh, there's fish. And closer at hand. Right, let's try this. I presume I just hold the mouse button and I just clicked the last time. No? Okay. Didn't work. Okay, you have to wait a wee bit and then then click. Okay, right. Um, I am going to stop there. I was just doing a couple of first quick looks um, to this evening. Um, this was Outpath, first journey. I'll just get my screen back up. There we go. Um, so. This is the free version just now, it's just a prologue, um, which came out earlier this month, a few days ago, uh, developed by David Morel Jo Sanchez, published by Grab the Games. Thank you again to Grab the Games for um, pointing the game out to me and sending a key, much appreciated. Uh, I shall look forward to the full version, I was really enjoying that. You've got different biomes, like snowy ones, optimization, crafted items are automatically collected. Hmm. What's a different areas? I wonder what they are. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, electricity or something. It looks like you can probably automate things quite a lot. Let's have a look in um, down here and see what it says. Um, features. Base building, automate everything. Buy islands to expand and exploit fishing. Play active or idle you choose. Uncover the secrets of a stylized, of the stylized place. So the full version is coming out next year. Uh, I'm going to follow that, add it to my list, I like that. Um, does it say anything else more in here? Or is it just the same? It just says the same. Yeah, that was good, I like that, a nice casual game. A lot of fun. 
right let me find somebody to raid quickly um, see who we've got going just now uh, i shall be back tomorrow evening probably um what's i was going to try and stream longer in the morning but i'll have to see how barren is i might have to do it in the evening um i do have two first looks lined up for the evening if i if it's then but i was going to be looking at the block in the morning and then playing quite a lot of june spice wars which is in early access just now uh right let me see who we got Got Sundercut is playing Trials of Cold Steel 3. Um, Lunartic is playing Rimworld. My trail, who I will follow, is playing Vampire the Masquerade. I don't know if anybody's got any particular preference. Um, I think I shall probably just head over to Sundercut. Unless anybody is anybody different. No, right. Okay, let me set the raid up. So, thanks for watching. If you don't already follow, follow would be greatly appreciated. Um, but thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. So, until next time, though, you all take care, be safe, and I shall say bye for now.